Hey guys, uh, Jordan here, and uh, I'm just playing a quick game of Black Ops. Uh, I actually did really bad, but uh, who cares? Alright, so um, we're going to be discussing Modern Warfare 3 and what's happening. So, Modern Warfare 3, the newest Call of Duty, obviously, coming out this November 8th. You know it's not November yet, but November 8th. Um, if you haven't uh, put it already, I suggest you go do it. It's going to be a really fun game. Um, uh, they have survival mode now, uh, multiplayer as always, campaign, blah, 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 spec ops. And then um, some of the new bonuses they have is double XP. So it's obviously just XP doubled. So you rank up a lot faster. Um, since they partnered up with Doritos and um, PepsiCo, I should say, cause, but it's Mountain Dew. But um, they, uh, they're they sponsors of uh, Mountain for 3. And um, if you go buy their stuff, um, you put in the code on duxp.com, and then when Modern Warfare 3 comes out, <coughs> so you put in your gamer ID, and then the double XP time goes to your account. But obviously, there's a limit of 24 hours, but you can go past it and just keep putting entries into a car. There's the the Modern Warfare 3 uh, Jeep. We got the Xbox, the Modern Warfare 3 Xbox, the controller, a hoodie. And the tur some turtle beaches and a lot of other good stuff. So uh, if you haven't already done that, check go check that out. Um, create an account if you or don't have one. So yeah, basically, um, Modern Warfare 3. It's probably gonna be the best of the Call of Duties. I'm thinking it's gonna be really good. Uh, <clears throat> I think it's gonna be. It's gonna reach out to more gamers for since they're bringing back quick scoping. There's gonna be a lot of stuff like that because there's like 20 billion clans now for quick scoping and trick shotting and stuff. But uh, uh, I can't wait to get my hands on a M4, A1, or any other gun. And uh, yeah, but uh, so now we're gonna talk about the uh, tokens. So <clears throat> Robert Bowling was talking about tokens and. Um, what they do so tokens are when you're when you have the game on Warfare 3 if you have prestiged in World at War Call of Duty 4 Mono Warfare whatever you want to call it uh, Mono Warfare 2 uh, Black Ops yeah so if you played all those games prestige uh, prestige at least once uh, you will have a token for that game. You can only have one token per game. So if you have all that, like me, you start off with four tokens. So yeah. And then what you when you uh, so for example, um, you are level one. You just prestiged. You have a token. Um, there's the best gun in the game. Let's say commando, or whatever. I'll just I'll just bring it out. Commando. You're level one. You don't have it unlocked. So you just have a token, you spend that token on that, and you have the gun for the whole prestige. So that is really fun. Um, that's going to be really, really fun uh, how they make this game and how they put it together. And I can't wait to see the graphics and how they uh, finish this product. And um, yeah, so <clears throat> Modern Warfare 3. Uh, it's going to be, um, I don't know, all this talk about Battlefield 3 versus Modern Warfare 3, I don't know. I haven't played Battlefield 3 myself. I played the beta a little bit. I really didn't like it. I'm not a Battlefield guy, but um, uh, I personally think Modern Warfare 3 is going to be the better seller, the better the better game, just because uh, us Call of Duty fans, we have more fans, and uh, I think that... Activision, Treyarch, all the um, Infinity War, they're reaching out more to their gamers and giving them what they want and uh, what they spent $60 on. Like, I don't understand why games are $60 when you play it for a day, beat the campaign, you're done. What, what else is there to do? But, uh, yeah. So, thanks guys for watching. Uh, you can keep watching if you want. Uh, I'm just not going to have anything planned. So, alright.